Hey everybody, it's Sneaky Picnic. Welcome to Minecraft Week Log. Do you remember this farm from last episode? This is the sheep shearing mega wool factory. Well, this week started by finishing this project. That took me roughly one day, and after I was done, I didn't like how it turned out. So I deleted it all and then built a new one, which took me about two days in total. Uh, yes, that's three days in total. Here's a clip for you to watch. As of right now, we've got this uh, sheep shearing wool factory all built. The structure is built, you can see we've got the rails all installed and ready. Uh, I ended up here because uh, right now oh, that was my cat by the way <laughs> you see we've got uh, these grass blocks over here and they end here this is because uh, here we have all the sheep uh, enclosed uh, by these iron bars and uh, no more sheep are left I need to breed them over over there you can see over there I'm breeding more sheep and one by one we need to get them into here into these chambers like this put grass on these dispensers and yeah then we will install rest of the rails and some uh, storage system so uh, but yeah the form is ready look at all this mess I'm done with the factory I want to show you so uh, this will be basically the entrance and uh, as you can see we have all the sheep I felt like this glass window would be cool also we've got these uh, small windows uh, which you can like look uh, like behind the scenes and now um, we've got this storage area and that storage area which is which is uh, not done yet there will be many more chests the idea is uh, we shear them and we collect the wool over here to this storage and then uh, we grab it and we put it into that storage over there right so we have some kind of uh, backlog or a spare wool and we got a lot of storage uh, but um, yeah we'll need all this here these two chests are for iron to make more shears yes we will put here a uh, redstone dust in between each of the dispenser and we will start shearing them up and as you can see they are all white that's actually another thing I want to talk about so what we'll do we will uh, here I have some colors we'll get some more and we will uh, you know dye these uh, all of these sheep and we'll collect a lot and I mean a lot of uh, black wool and we will use the black wool and the rest of the black wool that we don't use we put into the storage over there and then if we need uh, red wool for the red mountain bar we dye those sheep red and then we grab uh, then we you know uh, have a lot of red wool from over here and we use it and rest what we don't use we put inside there and so on and so on hello summer needed some wool so i delivered a few shelter boxes and then we expanded the black desert I also started preparing the swamp baum. Basically, I chopped down the trees that were there. And in the future, we're gonna do some terraforming. I want to use the color of the water. So I want to have a lot of water in that biome. Then I built with the rose farm in the end dimension, uh, but I did that off camera 
basically I followed Shulkercraft tutorial. At last I made a little progress on our bridge. It's not made out of cobblestone anymore. Hello Summer donated one shulker box full of red nether bricks and it's still in early stages but well at least something right. Okay now one more thing I want to talk about. As I was expanding the black desert and uh, then chopping trees in the swamp I came across a few caves. So now I have this idea. How about we connect all those caves, make some epic extensive cave system connecting even to our end portal which is basically cave as well and we could customize them. Sounds like a great idea to me. But that will be it for this week's episode of Vlog. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, consider subscribing and I'll see you next week. Goodbye.